Hey everyone, my name's Silver, welcome back to the channel, and today guys, I am here to bring you some Card Fight Vanguard theories. It's been a while since I've done one of these, and I really wanted to talk about this. And yeah, so let's hop right into it. So guys, with the Era of G coming over really soon, I mean, it, it's right around the corner. It's time to start thinking of what the next show will entail. So a lot of people are guessing or thinking that this sh the card fight vanguard shooting star will be the next series and i do hope it is but i don't necessarily think it will be i have several reasons for that one it's a i mean the manga is pretty good but i but um some people bring up good points whereas the show's targeted towards younger males from ages 10 to 14 it will Bushiro's business strategy will probably entail another male pr protagonist. But what does that do for the... What does that do? Um, I'm not... Being that um, the next series probably won't be based off of the Shooting Star series, but instead will incorporate the Shooting Star series into its story. So we'll get another male character or something like that that will be the main male character and will follow this current timeline i mean so far from what i've read and what i understand of the story it's not bad and it would be a really great story but past that there's not a lot it has going for it we've introduced a new clan and honestly i really hope that it does somehow make its way into the main series so let's let's talk about the characters so the only two characters we really have the main character and the main antagonist we start off with Asuki Matsumo. I can't read at all, but um, yeah. So she uses the deck called Unionverse, which we just recently got its name for. And we don't know too many of the units. We know a handful of grade threes, um, and I think AG unit and triggers. But it it. It's thus far a pretty it looks like a pretty strong anime um honestly I'm hoping that it does really well and I, I wish this was gonna be the next part of the series but I don't think it will be I think it's gonna follow another male character like I said that somehow incorporates this into being the main series um we don't have too much either. I think there's a total of three chapters released in Japanese and one fan chapter that was, uh, or not fan chapter, but a fan subtitled chapter. So, don't really know how that will work. We'll find out on March 14th when Bushiro does their uh, little episode where they're going to talk about the next movement. Um, we also know her father... We don't know much about her father. Oh, and see, there's actually nothing here. We know nothing about her father. Um, but let's move on to the antagonist. The number one tyrant, as he's, as I know him as. Um, so he uses... If we look at his deck, he uses a handful of... What I... Um, of Nova... Or Spike Brothers, sorry. And he has a card expecting rise, this Rising Nova card. Which we do have. So, like I said, I do see the main series being focused on this concept of 12 Tyrants uh, of the Crown. And that's sort of being the whole series focus point. I think it's going to be a G-heavy series with some sort of new... Um new mechanic i don't know what that new mechanic will be just yet i don't i don't know if bushiro has it entirely filled out but i don't think it's gonna be this guys honestly there's just i don't know i just i can't i don't think it works that well i would love it i would love to have a female protagonist honestly i would this she looks amazing and i would love her to be the main character for the series but we have to think from a business strategy. 
will she sell the game? Will she sell merchandise? And I honestly don't have that answer. I'm not going to say yes or no because I would buy merchandise for her. Um, past that, we also have this, which is Star Road, another Vanguard, which might be what the series is, being that there's, to my knowledge, no, oh, it might have, there's no actual comic. Um, I really don't know. But we have six new clans coming in. Or not new clans, but new themes. So, there's a lot here that can be really talked about. And I really just don't know where to take this video from here. I just wanted to state that I don't think she's going to be the next series. I don't think her story is the next story. At best, we'll get it as a side story. Or we'll get it like Legion series. Where she is... Where it's a strictly a subtitled show. But past that, we won't get anything really like that. We'll get another story... Which would I would be okay with if we only had this in sub. I mean, that's all I watch anyways. But, yeah. So, my thoughts are, is, or what I'm hoping for for the next series, is that we get a female lead. I would honestly love this story to be the main story, because it'd be amazing. But, just in case, I'm going to share some thoughts. I would, at very least, I'd like her to be a side character, one of the main characters... That follows, I guess, if it had to be an another male character around. Um, the main, the new main character's deck, I honestly would want to see something that hasn't really been touched upon yet. Either a whole new clan entirely, or a clan that isn't really used currently. So, like, something, I don't know, Murakumo would be a good one. Um, every clan gets support, so it's really hard to really pick and choose a clan that would be like oh well it has the least support so it would be nice to see honestly i would love to see luna in this series or a, another pale moon user like her because i love pale moon um who else what other clans do you guys think would be good let me know down in the comments below as i try to think of one real quickly um i know there's a whole bunch out there and there's a lot of clans that people love that have no support so, just let me know what you what you guys like for clans. Um, Dimension Police might not be a bad clan to get a support for in this series. Um, a main a main Great Nature clan would be awesome to see. Uh, I think that's about it. Um, a lot of clans, I mean, are underappreciated, but there's not a lot you can do with that. Um. You just have to think outside the box. I mean, even seeing a series with the mass collection in it would be awesome. For just any reason whatsoever. So I think the mass collection is a pretty nifty idea. But it will have to be one of those things that we wait and see that comes from. Alright, I think I've sort of shared my ideas. Um... I really can't wait to see what happens next, guys. March 14th honestly cannot come fast, fast enough. I know it's only five days away, but still. Five days is agonizingly long to wait to know about this series. So let me know what you guys' thoughts are down in the description below. And until next time, guys, I've been the Soul Wolf, and I will see you all later. Peace. Hey, everyone. Sorry about that. I know I've been doing this a lot. I keep forgetting to edit this in or say it before I leave but I wanted to let you guys know I have two giveaways going on currently on my channel you can find both those little videos by looking at my channel and how to enter those giveaways I'm having a lot of fun as of late and the growth on my channel has been a lot better in the past two months than I've had in the past year I've gained over 200 subscribers and honestly I couldn't be more thankful for all of it so guys, it would really help if you're new to subscribe to my channel, and please let me know what your thoughts are about my channel, what I could do differently, and what content I should add. I'm getting asked for a lot of Fortnite content, and being that Vanguard news is really slow right now, I'm planning on producing more. But if you have Vanguard idea videos that you'd like to see, please just tell me, and I will try to get it done. Um, Honestly, that's all I really had to say. I'm sorry I forgot to edit this in towards the end. Um, As you can see right now, I'm just sort of scrolling, looking for... Anything that would make a good video that I probably could have added in, but didn't. So, yeah. 
Alright guys, for real this time, until next time, I've been the Sword Wolf, and I will see you all later. Peace.